G'day folks, it's the old Grego here, your favourite Aussie larrikin. Or is that, uh, or is that, are you allowed to say that? Are you allowed to call people a larrikin nowadays? Well, if you are offended by that, then you're not allowed to say that word. Like many words we're not allowed to say anymore, uh, because someone might get offended. Like beer. Oh, I'm offended! Well, you can't use that word anymore. <laughs> That's how the world's turning nowadays. But I always keep using the word that people tell me not to use. <laughs> I even use that word. No, I better not say it. But uh, I just want to <laughs> thank some people. I want to thank Ajith Kumar. Thank you very much for your beer fund donation. It was really generous and I really appreciate it. It's gone to some good use too, Ajith. And, uh, well, John Beggs, he's got a Filipino wife. And he was watching my last... Um, it, my last beer review, and apparently she was in his ear, like they usually are, aren't they? But she was in his ear and said, mate, send him some money so he can do a San Miguel beer review. <laughs> so I just went to the bottle and grabbed some San Miguel. Oh yeah, can't wait. I'm sure the missus will be happy that at least someone's listening to her. <laughs> You can tell her that I'm listening. I know most men don't listen to their missus. I know I wouldn't. Sometimes I do. Especially when it's, dinner's ready. Oh, right, yeah. Oh, yeah. Or, come to bed, honey. Oh, yeah. Well, that's pretty rare, isn't it, when they do that one. Ah! A... For some people. <laughs> but uh, we're going to try the San Miguel today. And I'm going to have to turn the angel light on because uh, it's got some spiel on it. Now, San Miguel is actually from the Philippines. It's a Filipino beer, even though uh, it's a, a Spanish name. But the Spanish did occupy the Philippines and they, their language is part Espanol. And it's a 5% alcohol beer, 1.3 standard drinks per bottle. How many mils is even in this bottle? I'll have to turn the angel light on, okay? One sec. Oh, God! It's a bit warm, isn't it? Well, actually, it's, I'm looking pretty hot in my uh, flannel, aren't I? Now we get some temperatures raised, amongst some other things. Oh, boy! All right, so San Miguel, what's it say here? A truly satisfying beer with a refined, well-balanced flavour yeah, perfected and brewed following over a century old tradition of brewing excellence. All right. Uh, so this is actually imported from uh, the Philippines. But have a look at that. Look at, look at that writing there. And they, they, try, they expect you to like, read it with all those lines going through. That'd give like a, somebody with like epilepsy a fit, I think, trying to read that. Now, um, San Miguel, oh, we better crack it open, huh? I'm gonna turn the angel light off. Have a look at this in the meantime. Ah! Right, is it a twist top? <laughs> no, the Filipinos, well, <laughs> they're a little bit backwards, aren't they? <laughs> Sometimes, well, <laughs> well, we won't go there, but uh, let's try the San Miguel. Well, it didn't do much. It's got a bit of a frothy head on it at the moment because I was just at the bottle o and, uh, well, I walked home with it in my pocket. <laughs> it has been in the freezer, though, uh, for about 20 minutes, so hopefully it's chilled right down. It was cold from the cold fridge section, so. Now, I also stuck my beer glass in the freezer so it's nice and cold. I'm figuring this beer probably should be drank cold because the Philippines is a tropical country and it's stinking hot there. Oh, mate. Mate, you'd sweat breathing there. Okay, let's see how this beer goes. Oh, gee, it's a nice, clean looking beer, that one, isn't it? I'll try not to spill it today. I've actually moved uh, some of the things on the table uh, below me away so in case I do spill it it shouldn't go all over the floor but uh, there we go that beer is looking nice got some nice head happening 
Oh, it's a nice colour. It's kind of a, a bit of a lighter, a bit of a lighter colour, that one. And there's a bit of a fizz happening as well. Mm. Oh, yeah, it's got a real nice... Oh, I just lost it. It's, it's sort of a, a hoppy smell, but nice and uh, a light malty smell as well. Oh, it smells so good. I'll let you in on a little secret. That uh, that pale ale beer I had the other day. Oh, mate, didn't that night turn out to be a massive one? Oh, I tell you what. Uh, I can cut loose still, even though I'm pretty old. I can just really let my hair down, probably because it's falling out. <laughs> ah, that's a shame. Uh, anyway, let's try this beer. Oh, wow. Mm, I could just smell it. I'd like to like dab it on as cologne. Oh, yeah. Come get me, ladies. Oh, boys. Let's go. Oh, right. Okay. Right. Ah, oh, I see. Hmm. Not bad. It's kind of refreshing. Yeah, it's got a really nice blend of malt and hops there. I'm sort of waiting for the hops to do something, uh, but they don't. It doesn't seem to. Oh, hang on a sec. Oh, here it comes. Right. Okay. So the hops are slowly enveloping the back of my tongue and the back of the roof of my mouth. The malt just seems to hold its its flavour all the way through and mate, um, yeah, it tastes pretty good. It's not a bad one. It's got a bit of a, um, you know, a bit of that uh, that hoppy aftertaste to it. But um, yeah, it tastes pretty good. It's not exactly like my favourite beer, but I mean, <laughs> it's beer, mate. <laughs> That's what us beer drinkers do, isn't it? Drink beer. I see. When I was at the bottle, I, the one of the guys working there, he's always very friendly. He's always, "Have you tried this one? Oh, there's some of these pale owls left. You came in the other day to try that one." I said, "Yeah, I've already tried those. I'm looking for something else." And well, I got some other ones as well. I got some more different styles of beer, which I'll be trying along the way. So, this one here is a pretty nice one. Oh, what would it be like on tap? I wonder if they do tap beers in the Philippines and San Miguel's on tap. I'm pretty sure I've seen it on tap. But this one's imported. The one on tap would have to be brewed here, surely. I don't know if we even bother brewing San Miguel here. I mean, the Philippines is just up the road, really. Well, that's pretty easy to drink. Maybe a little bit too easy. I can see myself having another blinder tonight. <laughs> yeah! Well, it is, uh, what, Thursday night, isn't it? Tomorrow's Easter. Sweet. <laughs> I hope you've all gone to the bottle load today because it's going to be closed tomorrow, that's for sure. Luckily, I've stocked up thanks to Ajith and um, John and all those other people, of course. Uh, this is a pretty good beer. Ah. This would go down real well on a hot, stinging hot day. It probably even tastes good with a slice of lime in it, I reckon. Hmm. Yeah, quite enjoying this. Now, if you wanted to help out with my beer fund, I've got a link below in the description. It, it, it's looking all right, actually, but you never know. The right, It's a long weekend this weekend. I tell you what, it, it'll probably be, be all gone by, um, well, tomorrow. And I, uh, well, <coughs> excuse me, maybe not tomorrow, maybe Saturday morning. <laughs> Depends... If I stay up all night, or if I start, you know, have breakfast, uh, one of these for breakfast, which I would never normally do, except on the odd occasion, like maybe like this Saturday. <laughs> no, I won't, be, I won't be doing that. 
But yeah, the old San Miguel, like now, I, I've, all I can taste is uh, the hops in the back of my tongue. And, um, you know, it, 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 it has sort of got my, uh, my brain sort of a bit, little bit muddled. You know, I'm feeling a bit like Joe Biden at the moment. The words aren't exactly like spilling out really easily. But, um, well, I'm, uh, I'm set for a, a big night tonight. <laughs> Just me and like all my friends. Yeah, yeah. I'll be, well, we'll be telling old war stories. Yeah, mate, remember that time we went serving and there was like a, a, um, a, a, a dolphin? Yeah, I remember that. Pretty boring. Yeah, a night it's going to be. But uh, I will be playing my guitar. I know people want to hear this. Mr. Stripey Head is so good and bad to give him Stripey Head. There you go. And uh, let me just show you what I'm having for dinner tonight too. Might as well. Uh, sit down there, guitar. Just don't fall down. Here's my guitar, by the way. I've had this one for ages. It's a Washburn. I don't know how good it sounds, but it's left-handed because I'm a lefty. Not, not uh, by hand, not, uh, you know, the other way. Left-handed, I should say. That's my guitar. That's my table where I do, I spilt everything on the other day. I was all over the beers, but I mopped it all up. Or the cockroaches came and drank it all or something. But, yeah, let me show you. Oh! For dinner. Now, I don't know if you watch Greg's Kitchen, but I made these um, hot dogs the other day. And uh, they were county fair dogs. And it tasted so good, I decided I'd make it again. Now, I've only used red capsicums today. Normally, they didn't have... Well, they had them, but I bought the pack. I had a big pack of capsicums. I would have liked some green and yellow in there, but... Mate, this one, there's onion in there as well. But this is such a nice meal. And you just put it in bread. I've got some bread in the freezer, which I'll whip out later. And I'll whack in the old air fryer and defrost it and get it a little bit crispy. And then I'll just shove some of that in there. Ooh, mate, it's really nice. I really liked that recipe. It was delicious. So I'm having that for dinner. I already made it at lunchtime because I knew that, well, you know, once I start doing these beer reviews, who knows where the other... Uh, how the um, how the day will end up? I mean, what time is it? Yeah, it's it's um, mid afternoon, so well, you got to start sometime, right? Anyway, there you go, the San Miguel. Uh, will you be going out and trying one? If you do, mate, I'm sure you probably will like it. It's a it's a that's a different taste, and it tastes all right. Would it be a sessional though? <laughs> Yeah, it would be, and I'll tell you what, the next morning you'd be punished by it, I think. I, I know I would be, I'd be, uh, well, I'd be, well, let's just say, uh, if you called me, I wouldn't answer. Right, okay, well, there you go. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time for my next upload. I'll see you then. Bye.